Hello, welcome back to the channel. I'm Ron. Real quick video, lots of chatter online about the newest action camera, the DJI Action 5 Pro, and some of the comments are good, some not so good. Some people are having some issues, so that's what this video is about. Real quick, I heard some folks having issues with the camera, downloading the newest DJI MIMO app for this camera. So if you go online, you may find a couple of different versions of the app floating around out there. And if you don't use the right one, you're gonna run into some problems. For example, I noticed one link for the MIMO app, this is version 2.1.0, which requires iOS 14.0 or above for iPhones or 9.0 or above for Android users. And that's the one I'm showing you here. However, if I go to the app store from my iPhone, the MIMO app is version 2.1.1 released three days ago. And that does not indicate the minimum iOS requirements, but I'm assuming again, it's gonna be 14.0 or above for iPhone users. Finally, I logged into the app store from my computer and found version 2.1.2, which says it was released today, September 24th, 2024. Again, this one doesn't specifically spell out the minimum iPhone or Android system requirements. I'm gonna assume at least 14.0 or above. So real quick, if you're having any problems downloading or connecting or using this DJI MIMO app or using the newest DJI Action 5 Pro with it, double check that you have the newest and the most recent version of the MIMO app. It may just be a timing issue where the newest DJI MIMO app hasn't been pushed out to all the countries and regions yet here in the United States. Additionally, the version 212 indicates the following. It says add support for the Osmo Action 5 Pro. So as of today, September 24th, it looks like that's the version that you want to get, version 212. So again, just double check that's the one you're using. Oh, and on a side note, it appears DJI will be updating the firmware again. No dates with that to include higher bit rates on the DJI Action 5 Pro. I found this on the DJI forum just the other day after a bunch of folks were asking for higher bit rates due to compression being seen in some of the video footage. I'll leave links down below if you want to read through the actual thread yourself. You can do that. As you can see, this was the response from one of the DJI R&D developers, someone on the R&D team, regarding updates and bit rates for the next firmware release. And in short, DJI's newest action camera provides a max video bit rate, again, max of 100 megabit per second, compared to the newest GoPro 13 Black, which has a max bit rate of 120 megabit per second. So be on the lookout for that as well. That's it, quick video. Hope that helps. We'll see you in the next one. Take care.